Hello everybody and welcome to Bull Technology. I never quite understood the point of gaming mice. Well, let me correct myself. I, I understood the point of them, but I could never justify spending a ludicrous amount of money on something as trivial as a mouse. But on Prime Day 2022, Razer was selling their Death Adder Essential Mouse for only $18.99. And seeing that I needed a new mouse, I decided to give it a purchase. So today, we'll review something I never thought I'd own. A Razer product. And in the interest of full disclosure, Razer is not sponsoring this video, and all of the opinions you're about to hear are entirely my own. Let's get started. I have long since been frugal with my gaming peripherals. In my mind, it was always more important to spend a few hundred more dollars on PC components than it was to have a fancy keyboard and mouse. And nowhere is this more evident than in my choice of mouse. This heinously cheap Logitech mouse has been my main gaming mouse for almost five years. It's pretty ergonomically unfriendly, and given that the scroll wheel has recently failed, well, I was in the market for a suitable replacement. Enter the Razer Death Adder Essential Mouse. This mouse features mechanical buttons, a DPI of 6400, green LED lights, and of course, the Razer logo. This mouse usually retails for a hefty $29.99, however I purchased it on sale for $18.99, a 38% discount. Unboxing the mouse is incredibly straightforward. Inside the box is the mouse, a literature packet, and doing their best Apple impression, a single Razer sticker. Out of the box, the mouse features a 5-foot cable, which feels a fair bit nicer than most other mice cables, and rather pretentiously, a USB cap at the end of the cord, which reveals the green USB insert. But enough of its subtly overdone features. How does this mouse function? In all honesty, incredibly well. Upon hooking it up to my PC, I was incredibly surprised at its accuracy. Tracking with this mouse is excellent, and it really makes other mice feel like wielding a shoe in comparison. Moving on to the left and right clicking buttons, and they really do have a satisfying and purposeful click. On my previous mouse, the clicking was vague and squishy, and clicking either button rattled the mouse. Uh, needless to say, this isn't an issue with the Razer mouse. The scroll wheel is also excellent. It's smooth, and the scroll wheel click instills confidence. My only real complaint is that the scroll wheel does have a slight rattle when quickly scrolling. It's still nowhere near as bad as my previous mouse, though. The Death Adder Essential also features two programmable mechanical buttons on the side of the mouse, and these are pretty handy when gaming. By default, they are set to your browser's forward and back buttons. So let's now discuss its design and ergonomics. Uh, this is perhaps the first mouse that actually fits well in my hands. Its size and weight are proportional, and it's just a comfortable mouse to use. Uh, I should also briefly mention that this mouse is available in either black or white. So what about the LED lights? Well, I understand that a lot of quote-unquote gamers like flashy lights, but I really don't. Uh, this is a minor complaint though, and at least the lights stay off when your PC is sleeping. So there you have it, the Razer Death Adder Essential Mouse. Do I recommend it? Yes, but with one major condition, the price. At the mouse's MSRP of $29.99, I'd say it's a pretty steep price, but if you can get one for $18.99 like I did mine, I'd say this is a quality product that is definitely a step up from other cheap mice. So be sure to leave a like, a comment, and definitely subscribe. And thank you all for watching.